I wasn't going to put Kate George, a chef extraordinaire and, of course, owner of the food room, on the spot to ask her how she feels about moving in. Is it too soon? <laughs> Is it not? Um, but we love having her as a resident here in our Espresso kitchen. We love Mondays. Why? Because we cook frugally. It's a frugal feast. We take leftovers or things that you might have in your house that you might not necessarily know how to use and use them. And we are pushing the boat out today with the beautiful artichoke. And believe it or not, globe artichokes, not only beautiful to look at because they are indeed a flower, something quite sought after after as well in the food world, having an actual day dedicated toward them. So unofficially today is going to be our artichoke day. Um, Kate, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for bringing these beautiful flowers. Are they a fruit or are they a vegetable, a flower? They're actually a, ve a flower. A vegetable flower. No, a flower. <laughs> They're a flower that we that we um, eat as a vegetable. So this would be kind of um, the flower pot. And then when they come into bloom, they actually have like a purple afro that like pops oh, out cool. over the There's top of it. There's something like quite protea like yeah. about them. Mm. They're very hardy, which means that preparation is important. We're going to mm. do three different styles. Before we get on to our first recipe, which looks really easy, preparation is key, I'm guessing, yeah. with an artichoke. So the thing about an artichoke, I always think, some, some, somebody must have looked at this, this and thought, wow, that's delicious. But there's only <laughs> been really, really, really hungry. <laughs> yeah. um, there's only a small part of the artichoke that is actually edible. The leaves are very um, kind of hardy, hardy and stringy. <laughs> so you, inside is a little bit of meat that you, that's the actual the the artichoke ah. heart. So what you would normally do is, if you want to get fancy with your artichoke, you, you kind of trim off the first little top bit. Yeah, I see what you mean. See, Those leaves are quite yeah, hardy. They yeah, they really are rough. Um, and that's what it looks like inside. So you can just, you can cook artichokes in any number of ways. You can steam it whole without cutting off the top. You, if you go to a restaurant, you're probably going to have, they'll take a pair of scissors and sort of cut off the, off yeah, the, the le you, no, not the, these, these leaves have got little spikes on the end. Oh, wow. So it's very like bad form to serve a spiky artichoke in a restaurant. I, I, I would say so, but that's obviously to protect them in the wild yes. with them being very uh, delicious <laughs> wild animals, I'm yes. sure, tend to, yeah. to drift towards I them as well. I thought about that actually. Mm, chief, man. Okay, <laughs> so what we're going to do today is we're going to do a basic thing. So this is what you do if you were serving it to friends. These are quite small ones, so you would probably, I would say one or two per person. Okay. And we're just going to steam them. So we've got right. a pot of water over here, okay. and you literally right. can just pop your artichokes in. I've got a little bit of water at the bottom, about an inch or so. These nice. are quite small artichokes. You can pop the yeah, lid on. Um, these are quite small artichokes. They probably take about 20 minutes. Um, but you can get enormous ones that are big, real big flowers, and those can a up bouquet to... of yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can. Uh, those might take up to 40, 40 minutes to cook. So what is really delicious about an artichoke is that it's got a very gentle, buttery flavour. So it loves butter as a, as a condiment, but it also loves something with a bit of acid. So it's a nice sounding board for, yeah. for acidic foods. So Beautiful. we are going to just make a little lemon butter. So this is your quick, easy artichoke I love this. recipe. As we said, frugal, and, <laughs> and this is how we do it. No, but the whole idea of these segments is to make it as simple as possible for you to do something stupendous with mm. really simple ingredients. And the keyword here, if you'd like this ingredients list as we continue on our way, is snack to double three seven two eight. So some parsley's gone in. Yeah, I, I, parsley's my choice. I like it. So you, it's really up to you. Mm, it goes well with the butter. Mm. Taste I like and the, the lemon little combo. freshness and yeah, especially with the garlic. Um, squeeze a bit of lemon juice in. We're going to put a bit of black pepper. Beautiful. This really is simple. I like yeah, that. Don't, don't mess with the taste of the, mm. the artichoke heart. It's, mm. As you said, it's got a beautiful buttery taste as yeah. it is. So this is just going to kind of yeah. accentuate it, that. Absolutely. Mm. So this is like, this is, I always think artichokes are, this is, they tell you summer's coming because they, they very, have a very short season and they're very simple, kind of prehistoric looking vegetable. Yeah. Um, so what we've got here is a couple that I've done already. So I'm just going to pull, pull this butter into a bowl. Beautiful. So you don't even, once they've been steamed, they are sorted and That's ready to it. go. So what you want to do though, now this is the important part, is how to actually eat an artichoke. People don't know. So you can get, put a bowl in front of them and it looks a bit like that and it, yeah, probably it's probably a bit daunting. A bowl of proteus, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what is important is that um, the meat of the artichoke is actually going to be at the base of the leaves. So what you do is you peel the leaves off, you oh, dip wow. them in your garlic butter, and then you just eat the fleshy bit at the base of the leaf. Before you, you hit the sinews and the throat. Yes. Okay, well, I'm going to dive right in and taste that again. Yeah. That key word is snack to double three, seven to eight, and some bread to dunk into our sauce as well. Can I dip one in? Can yeah, I go for it, point? go for it. Oh, lovely. Kate, you're joining us again for another two artichoke-inspired segments this morning. I apologize to the rest no, of the co-presenters. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That is amazing. 
Well, if you're having issues in your relationship, artichoke hearts might go a long way to repairing it. Now, we're actually discussing something quite important this morning. When is the right time to move in together?